Over at the National Assembly, a parliamentary defense committee reviewed the recent inter-Korean crisis with the nation's defense minister, Han min attending the session. Park ji has the details. Lawmakers from both sides of the aisle praised the military's response during the recent inter-Korean confrontations, but grilled the defense minister on some specific details regarding the agreement reached by two Koreas on Tuesday. Some lawmakers questioned the clarity of the wording of the deal by the two Koreas. They particularly pointed out a clause in the agreement that states the South will stop its anti-Pyongyang propaganda broadcast at the border unless abnormal situations happen. Han was asked on what could constitute abnormal and whether its meaning was agreed upon by both Koreas. To further illustrate the ambiguity of the word, lawmakers asked whether a cyber warfare or missile launches by Pyongyang fall into the criteria of being abnormal. To this, the defense minister said he cannot give an answer for now, adding that abnormal situation is something to be judged comprehensively by the government. What I understand about an abnormal situation is that while it's certain military provocations like this one will be considered an abnormal case, we need to comprehensively judge the situations rather than specifically predetermining which cases would be seen as an abnormal situation. Lawmakers also questioned the defense minister about what South Korea earned through the crisis and the subsequent marathon negotiations. I believe we've secured our national unity, that we will firmly respond to Pyongyang's provocations and clearly show the North that we will punish any of their provocations. An improvement in inter-Korean relations is an additional achievement on our side. However, lawmakers expressed concerns over Hwang byung seo one of the two chief North Korean negotiators during the inter-Korean talks, who recently denied Pyongyang's involvement in the landmine attack in a TV interview broadcast in the North. Lawmakers said Hwang is not only giving North Korean viewers an opposite interpretation of the result of the inter-Korean talks, but even adding extra wording that was not stated in the original agreement. They asked the defense ministry to clarify the meaning and understanding of the agreement with the North to prevent differing opinions that could hamper improved inter-Korean relations. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.